Hey guys, it's Eric and we are going to be checking out Choa's Yesterday. It has been so long since I've heard her voice. I mean, I always I listen to AOA just because they have bangers and stuff. Um, and just to hear her voice sometimes. Uh, but it's just been so long um, since she has released anything, and I'm just just so I'm just so excited to hear her voice once again um so yeah i wish there was english, english subtitles with this video there's not um but we're still gonna be checking this out anyway so i won't waste any more of your time and you know what it like go oh. oh it's cute i like the font how it's showing up Visuals are really dope. Ooh. Oh, that's trippy. That tripped me out. That's cool. Looks really dope. So it's a little weird because it's post lighting. But I will say that most of the times if some CGI looks a little off, it may be because the lighting's off. I like the song though. So it's very interesting to see what like Cause So Was part of like the era Especially for girl groups Where they would Kind of make them sing Differently than how their actual voice Or their natural singing voice would be So it's interesting to hear her voice like this And there's Many idols who sound like that. That's why King of the Mass Singer was always so interesting. Because you can get an artist on there whose voice singing is completely different to how they sound in the recordings live on the tracks. Cause oh, the about tone was always like her tone was so unique and specific, but like but visually, this is so stunning. I really like the song itself. I think it's really, really dope. I think it's really, really, like, I really like the song. I really do. I like the sound for it. I like the vibe. I like how she's singing the song. You know, she was known as, like, main vocal, lead vocal of AOA, and so she would always have, like, the bigger parts of the song and stuff. Um, so, like, you, the, with those, you expect them to always just have, like, bigger... When they do solo stuff, just showcase that stuff. And she has before, I think, right? Has Choa done? <laughs> Am I tripping? Please don't tell me I'm tripping. Choa. No, she has done different 
Um, actually, she's released a handful of songs. What was Box Tape? Oh, that was her primary. Okay. Um, or she has done, um, like, OSTs and stuff like that. So that's, you know, that's a little bit different. Um, but, yeah, but I... I really enjoyed it. I thought it was great. I think the song, again, is just really, really dope. I like the vibe of it and stuff, and it's interesting to get hear her like voice like this. And it could just because it's a little more kind of talk singing-ish and not her going just like big vocals, you know, kind of like she would in different like AOA songs. And so, so maybe that's why the voice sounds a little bit different. Again, it's probably been a, it's been a hot second. So my brain could be like playing me, playing with me like it always does. Um, but, but yeah, you know, it's always interesting to sort of hear that. And sometimes, again, you do get those, like, things during, like, King of the Mass Singer. Like, some people are, you're, you're just like, I know that's Ryan Reynolds. You know what I mean? Like, <laughs> there's no doubt about it. Um, about what certain, like, when certain uh, artists go on to that song or singers, you know it's them. You know, there's no... There's no if and or buts about it. But then sometimes you're just like, that was your voice and stuff just because how they are made to sing for a group or, um, and I'm kind of, well, I don't know if it happens with soloists as much as like with groups, um, but like how their voice sounds that versus like, again, their natural voice. It's, there's, there's a handful of them who sort of, again, come from this sort of generation of K-pop where that's kind of like what it was like meant to be and stuff versus now all the newer groups that are debuting, both boy group and girl group wise, it's a lot more focused on the individuality and tone of the members voices you know what i mean that was not always the case and stuff you know k-pop was you know always a very manufactured type of thing and you were always kind of replaceable as an idol you know what i mean um so it's like you could just pick you out just put someone else in there you know what i mean um it's sort of like how i'm, I'm sure it still kind of goes that way um uh, but there is definitely a greater focus on the individual um and what an individual can bring to a group these days than where there were before you know what i mean um so especially for girl groups um back in the day so well not back back in the day but previous generations of k-pop um but it was really beautiful to hear her voice i think the visuals are really really stunning absolutely love them um except for the cgi and it's because the lighting they tried to get away with it with the shadows on the grass and stuff and they did do post-production lighting on her but if you have a light coming from here and there's no shadows hitting under the face then it's gonna look weird you know what i mean um so sometimes with cgi looks bad that can be the case because the lighting on the person is not matching the lighting of the environment or where the light sources are in that world so that's why it can get a little uncanny valley-ish you know what i mean and that was the case here i thought it was really really dope though i like the sort of environments that they did put her in that were cgi I just wish the lighting matched a little bit more um than it would have looked as weird but um i really enjoyed it i loved hearing her voice again i really really enjoyed the song and i thought it was overall really dope and great and wonderful i loved it go to put your thoughts in the comments down below to that much i was yesterday if you like this video give this video a thumbs up if you like to me and want to see more of my videos go to hit that subscribe button if you want to see my videos the second they come out hit that notification button if you want to follow me on social media twitter instagram such at tiktok or description down below at the end screen share this video to your friends thank you guys so, so much for watching love you and i'll tell you guys later bye Baby,